A map that could reveal where Nazis hid looted riches that could be worth millions during World War II has gone on view to the public for the first time. It is among hundreds of secret papers about World War II which have finally been uncovered to the public. The treasure map claims to show where German soldiers buried a haul of valuables stolen during the Battle of Arnhem in the Netherlands in 1944. The map was hidden away for years in the National Archives of the Netherlands with clues to a never-found treasure. Watches, diamonds and jewelry are believed to be just a few of the valuables stolen from the bank in the city of Arnhem. The map is thought to show the exact spot where the hall was hidden in Gelderland, it suggests the loot is buried between the Dutch villages of Ameren and Linden. Over the years there have been multiple searches for the booty, but nothing has been found, with the hall potentially being found by treasure hunters. In one attempt to find it, the Dutch state even brought a Nazi officer back to the country to help with the search, but nothing was recovered. It could also have been found at random by passers-by and not reported or collected by Nazis before the end of the war. One expert told told a local broadcaster that German soldiers had put loot in their coats during the theft at a bank. Annette Watkins, of the National Archives, said, during the defense of Arnhem, there was an explosion at a branch of the Rotterdamsch Bank on the Velperweg. The documents have been released as part of the Archives Open Access Day. They also include documents from a committee that looked into allegations of abuse at Dutch internment camps towards suspected collaborators. The archive contains harrowing stories of torture, humiliation and revenge against this group of illicit Dutch people. Leg irons used to chain detainees together, sometimes for weeks, are tangible evidence of the often inhumane conditions in these post-war camps. It is not the first time that rumors of buried Nazi loot have sparked the imagination of treasure hunters. Last year a row broke out between enthusiasts searching for Nazi gold and historians saying they were looking in the wrong place. The Silesian Bridge Foundation had been digging up the grounds of an 18th-century palace in the Polish village of Minkowski where they believed 200 million pounds of Nazi gold and other valuables stolen by Himmler's SS was hidden. It was sparked after the foundation said the location was revealed in a war diary written by an SS officer at the end of the Second World War. But historians who the foundation invited to verify the diary said their analysis was not completely positive. Posting on Facebook, the historians from a group called the Discoverer Magazine Exploration Group, Gemo, said. Our most important finding is that the village of Minkowski is not mentioned in the war diary. This may be hard for the foundation, because it is the only place their excavation works are being carried out at this moment. For now, the fate of the treasured items remains unclear.